Okay, everybody, it's Abstract Possibilities. And as everybody knows, I've been in and out of the hospital a whole bunch lately. And they've added a new medical apparatus to my house. And the nebulizer. And I'm so tired of looking around the house and just seeing pill bottles and inhalers and uh, just driving me crazy. So I decided that if I'm going to have to have all this stuff around here, I need to make it cute, at least cute. So I got a little container here. As you can tell by the Dremel, I know nothing of how to use one. So I'm sure those that know are laughing their booties off. If you've got any, you know, tips or links to videos on how to correctly use this tool, I'm more than happy to look at it. Anyway, I wanted to put a hole in the back of this so that I could put the uh, cord to the nebulizer outside the back. And that way I, it would just be plugged in all the time and I wouldn't have to mess with it. I had to go through several tips of this Dremel because again, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm trying to make this hole big enough for the, uh, the head of the, the cord to come out. Which in the end, I finally did get done. And then I decorated it with um, scrapbooking paper and some silk flowers and a couple little angels. And just that when you look at the box, because the box can be sealed, you don't necessarily see that it's all this medical stuff. And uh, yet I know it's there. But I also have grandkids and I don't want them grabbing at medications that they shouldn't. So, and I do so much art stuff, they don't mess with my art stuff, so the boxes they won't even mess with. I've got this little one I did for the nebulizer and uh, the meds that go with that and the tubes and the hoses and mouthpieces and all that. That's what will hold this. And then I have a big one that I have to do um, that's going to hold all that other medication. And then I even bought a, um, because with this abuterol and with my sats dropping so low, I forget when and what I'm doing things. So until I can get my strength back up again, I bought a little notebook that I, you know, write down when I've had a breathing treatment or when I've taken this pill or when I've done that. And that way I don't have to worry about trying to remember. It'll all be documented and I'll know when I'm supposed to do it again. Just keep me in your prayers while I get try to get you back through this bout of it. I haven't had this bad of a bout since 2014, right after the first time I got sick. So this has been kind of scary and I'm not bouncing back as quick as I would like. We're just putting everything else behind. I'm doing my best. But I'm trying to turn it into a positive. So I had to do a video on it. And now I've got myself a nice little container to my nebulizer to hit in. And nobody even has to know it's there. Okay guys, thanks for your support. If you haven't subscribed, please do. Make sure you click the bell. Because YouTube's unsubscribing people again. Or their algorithm or something is. So click the bell so you no get notified whenever I load a new one. Um, we have everything from collabs on here to paintings to you name it. I have almost 300 videos to choose from. There's going to be something here for somebody. Um, enjoy your day, everybody. Have a wonderful weekend. I do believe the weekend's coming. So you guys have a great day, and I'll see you on the next video. Bye.